during a pandemic, during a time of uncertainty. Nung sumali ako dito, I wanted to prove something. Sa pamilya ko, sa sarili ko. It was the first for me. Sa isip ko, baka last chance ko na to. Kaya pinush ko yung sarili ko. Pinaglabang ko to. But then, COVID-19 happened. Everything was put on hold. Even my dream. To be a super bot. After months in quarantine, you get to learn what really matters in life. Your family, your health, and the health of our world. That's why you have to decide to keep on fighting. Because life, well, life goes on. I told myself, I will stay strong. Tuloy ang workout. Try ko. Jim ko. Kahit saan, para parahan. And of course, tuloy pa rin ang healthy diet. Because health starts with what you eat. As a super bot, I want to keep inspiring people to be healthy now more than ever. Yes, yeah, super bots is still on. Our passion for health lives on. The show must go on. Filipinas must all witness the strength of the super bot spirit. We stay strong, we fight on, we are super bots. is tougher, riskier. So our health must be stronger. Eat right every day. Fish every day. With Century Duna. Now, more than ever. Stay, Stay strong, strong, Filipinas! Filipinas. is tougher, riskier. So our health must be stronger. Eat right every day. Fish every day. Put Century Duna. Now, more than ever. Stay, Stay strong, strong Filipinas. Filipinas.
Hello everyone, Shelly Victor here. How are you guys doing? Now, I hope you are all safe and sound in your homes or wherever it is that you might be right now. Thank you for tuning in and I promise to make your weekend a fantastic one. Welcome to Stay Strong, The Launch. Sounds intriguing, right? What do you guys think we are launching? Hmm, think about it and share those thoughts in the comment section down below and you just might be one of the lucky viewers who will receive special gifts from Century Tuna. Trust me, you would want to get your hands on those, so comment away. 10 lucky viewers will receive a special gift from Century Tuna, so watch out for the announcement via the Century Tuna Superbots Facebook page. Hey, you're already on that page, that's where you're watching us, so just keep it locked in, alright? It is indeed your lucky day because today marks the official launch of the finalists of the Century to the Everybod Superbod 2020. Yay! We will get to know them today! Last February, we did the Go Seas in Cebu and Manila. It was then followed by the final callback where we selected who made it to the cut. And finally, we will be meeting our finalists. Are you all excited? Well, I definitely am. Now, before we move forward, let me thank our sponsors for being with us in this journey. Century Tuna Everybody Superbot 2020 is co-presented by Gold's Gym. Major sponsors, Shakey's and Derma World. Minor sponsor, Calcium C. You know, 2020 might be a different year from the previous Century Tuna Superbot's executions, but this does not hinder us to inspire more people to stay strong. Stay strong. Such a powerful statement, right? We will know more about the Stay Strong campaign and stay strong as we move on to our program. But for now, let us look back at how Century Tuna Superbods paved the way in promoting a healthy and fit lifestyle to us Filipinos. Here is the EVP and COO of Century Pacific Food Incorporated, a super bot himself, Mr. Ageless. We've got Mr. Greg Banzon. Century Tuna has always been committed to health and fitness. Century Tuna Super Bods is the company's most successful campaign to date. The main purpose of the Century Tuna Super Bods competition was to look for an anchor that the company could use to promote health and fitness. Back in 2006, when we first started, less than 50 joined the Century Tuna Super Bods competition. 14 years later, over a thousand show up to the GOSIS. The competition helped lift the equity of the Century Tuna brand, therefore becoming the undisputed market leader in the tuna category. Century Tuna Superbods is actually for everyone. We've taken pains in making sure that we highlight real people rather than just celebrities in the efforts to promote health and fitness through this competition. Every two years, the competition evolves with exciting themes and categories from transformation with John Lloyd Cruz, Voice Night Out, and introducing the Ageless category, and now every bod super bod where we open the competition to everyone. The Century Tuna Super Bods competition was a tactic to reach the market via the non-celebrity route and I think that dynamic makes it very interesting and exciting. So it's the, in, the competition is both friendly but very intense. Featuring real people who have incorporated Century Tuna into their lives with the benefits displayed for all to see and appreciate. This was through Super Bods at Home. This is our message that Century Tuna is not just for bodybuilders, celebrities, and commercial models, but for everyone. It is vital for Century Tuna to constantly give new messages and excite our market. This 2020 might be a challenging year, but the competition continues its mission to be the champion of health and fitness. We came up with the theme, Stay Strong Filipinas, and we felt that this was our contribution to providing uplifting messages for the Philippines as we battle through this pandemic together. Despite the limitations and challenges, expect to see a different and exciting Century Tuna Super Bods with Every Bod Super Bod Reloaded 2020. Thank you, Mr. Greg Banzon. A virtual round of applause for him, please. Wow. 
You know what? It seems just like yesterday when I first hosted Super Bonds. We've been all over the Philippines for the Go Seas. We even went to Boracay for the finals. Now, aside from personally witnessing the journey of the finalists, I love how the competition became a source of inspiration to Filipinos who want to achieve a healthy and fit lifestyle. But we've seen transformations of celebrities and non-celebrities. And two years ago, it's all about sexy knows no age with the inclusion of the ageless category. And this year, Century Tuna Superbots communicates the stay strong attitude. Let us know more about this campaign with the marketing director of Century Pacific Food Incorporated. We have Mr. Carlo and Daya. Hi, Carlo. Hi. Hello, Jelly. Nice to see you again. It is so nice to see you and everyone else. It is good to be reunited with my Century Pacific family. I am wondering, Carlo, how are you doing? How is Century Tuna doing right now? Oh, Jelly, thanks for asking. So, as you have probably observed when you go out and shop, a lot of people have decided to stock up on Century Tuna during these times. So a lot of people have been eating a lot from home. So we've been very, very busy the past few months making sure that we have enough Century Tuna to go around for everyone. Um, but aside from that, we just had our Super Bots at Home digital program with a lot of workouts and recipes that you can do at home. And now we have our Stay Strong Filipinas campaign for Century Tuna Super Bots. You know what, Carlo? First of all, on behalf of all the Filipinos who cannot live without Century Tuna, thank you for actually becoming busier just to make sure that the Filipinos get that, have their cans of Century Tuna because I'm one of those who panicked when I saw that the shelves were running out of Century Tuna. So thank you for doing that. And then aside from providing the food, you provided home workouts and recipes that can keep everyone busy. But now, you've provided the Stay Strong campaign. May I know, what is the inspiration behind this campaign? So Jelly, we all remember that we launched Century Tuna Every Bot Super Bot 2020 back in January. And we were all caught by surprise by the global pandemic that hit us. So we had to rethink our efforts and ensure that we put safety as our first priority. So there are a lot of activities that we have to replan, rethink, and postpone as well. So we realized that the current reality is now tougher and riskier. But we also believe that health is still our best defense. So the Stay Strong Filipinas campaign is our call to action for the Philippines to stay healthy, both physically and mentally. So times are tough, but that should not stop us from becoming better versions of ourselves. Absolutely. Times may be tough, but we have to be tougher. So I think the Stay Strong campaign is perfect for that. And I think now more than ever, people are really prioritizing on their health. So it's a good thing that Century Tuna is providing the healthy meals plus the workouts at home. It's fantastic. But I'm curious, what are now the new directions of the EveryBod SuperBod competition? A oh, good question. So we've always defined the role of the Century Tuna Superbot as that of a Filipino health inspiration. So each Superbot finalist's goal is to inspire people everywhere, whether a friend, a relative, office mate, schoolmate, or maybe simply a fan, to live a healthier life. So make healthier choices and enjoy themselves in the process. So the Superbots are our fit inspirations. That's what we call them. So and now we need them more than ever. These kinds of inspirations. And for this year's competition, you will see the Century Super Balls like you've never seen them before. You'll get inspired by how they have managed to cope, adjust, and stay strong in the new world we are facing so that they can still become better versions of themselves. And of course, with Century Tuna always by their side. You know what? I will be talking to our SuperBots finalists in just a few minutes and I'm pretty sure everyone is excited to find out as well how they've managed to stay fit and healthy you know, throughout this whole ordeal. But right now, what can we look forward to after this uh, Stay Strong launch? So for sure, after the Stay Strong launch, you'll see the competition. It's going to be very exciting. It's going to be new. It's something that you've never seen before. And you will see more of the super bots in different situations. So a lot of exciting things to see. But after the competition, you can make sure that you see more of them, especially the winners. And you can look forward to new ways of enjoying Century Tuna. There are a lot of exciting Century Tuna dishes coming up that will help make your health journey enjoyable and more delicious. 
You know what? The finals is definitely on. Watch out for that. We will have winners. And just like Carla said, you will be seeing more of these winners. And of course, Century Tuna. Thank you so much, Mr. Carla and Daya. It is great to see you again. Thank you for giving us those important details about the Stay Strong campaign. I am sure our viewers were enlightened and more importantly, they are excited for what's to come. Thank you, Carlo. Thank you. Stay strong. Speaking of which, are you guys ready to meet our finalists for this year? I'm sure you are. Comment down below right there where you've been commenting. Please let us know who it is you're looking forward to seeing today. Century Tuna will select 10 viewers who will receive special gift packs. Keep those comments coming in because we want to know what you guys think of our launch. Now, while you're commenting, allow me to thank our wonderful sponsors. Century Tuna Everybody Superbod 2020 is co presented by Gold's Gym. Major sponsors Shakey's and Derma World. Minor sponsor Calcium C. Thank you again to all of our sponsors. And now, I think we are ready for this moment we have waited for months. We took a pause, but now we are back, stronger than ever. Here are the finalists of the Century Tuna Everybody Superbot 2020. My name is Hans. GN. Candice. Carla. Hey. It's Robert. Carlos. Eminem. Grace Del Rosario. Albert T. Lorenzo. John Paolo. Philippe Magona here. Samantha Ashley Lowe. Astrid Hernandez. Julian Rojas. Kirk Bundat. I'm Nicholas Chua. Brenda Del Jose. Zay Abido. I'm Sam Fervor. It's Kathleen. And Menzo. This is Jason. Katrina here. I'm Lynn. This one. I'm Shirley. This is Ari. Christine here. Hi, I'm Jojo. And hi. It's Malcolm. Sam. It's me, Shirley. Wax. Wax. I would rather a laser. Like a dragon. What else? Unicorn. Definitely my ass. My booty. My bomb. True. But they both char. Oh, uh, give me one million pesos, baby. <laughs> low carbs or low sugar? Low carbs. Right? I could never live without pizza and bread. It's a German in me. Isn't carbs also sugar? What is dieting? Well, besides my butt. I like being kissed in the ears, cheeks, lips, neck, and butt. You gotta get a little kiss on the booty sometimes. Spicy tuna sisig with tofu. 
tuna pasta. Just a plain one and a, mix it with a hot and spicy one. Uh, date someone younger because I'm a bit old already. Pag mas patanda sa akin, 90 na yun. Um, age doesn't matter. Breaks in oil. For sure, because that's a classic. Almost scary. Have you, like, had some with a little salt, pepper, a little cheese, a glass of wine? Oh my god. Who's the most confident super bot? I'd have to say it, it's probably Albert. That guy has his shirt off 24 7. <laughs> Mom, surely, for sure. And I really admire her. I will say myself. Because lahat na kami confident. Eh. We're here. I would say Christine. I'd call her a machine. I mean, she works, she's a student, and she trains like a beast, like all the time. Si TikTok Albert, because nakaka entertain yung mga TikTok. Oh no! <laughs> Samantha? Samantha. Marami nito sabi about name of Sam, but na, when I see Ong ano, pwede nga siya maging crush ko <laughs> sa ngayon. <laughs> Sam, fervor. <laughs> <laughs> You know, she might be too noisy. I can imagine her already saying, like, are we there yet? Are we there yet? I don't know. I'll have to unseat you for, for Grace because she cooks a lot of food if you've been following her on Facebook. Uh, fashionable, super bod. I would say K. Definitely just with her bob, it's gotta be Astrid. On fleek! It is Philip. She has this really punk, bad boy vibe to it, and I like it. Ooh, bad boy. Dating advice to a fellow super bod would be to never compromise your values. Patawanin mo lang ng patawanin yung kadate mo. Patotoo ka lang sarili mo. Just enjoy, don't overthink it. Keep it simple. Practice chivalry. Make sure to be yourself and whoever you'll find, they'll love you for who you are. I would love to be in a horror movie. <laughs> With my partner, of course. Papa, <laughs> Papa Jason sang it. Like a slasher movie, like Scream. And I think the perfect super bot to play a character is Kathleen to play the, the <laughs> character of Drew Barrymore. I think the biggest girl always gets killed first. So I think Kathleen is Samantha Perver because you're both animal lovers, dog lovers. Sam Perver, a puppy because she just lost her dog and she's really sad about it. Well, not me. Obviously, I would never choose me because that is a lie. I would have to refute. I think it would have to be hands. No! <laughs> I would choose Samantha Purple and I would like to pick her brains out and put it on my and on, put it on top of my brain because she has so much ideas. Nicolas Chihuahua because um he's quiet but apparently when you get to talk to him you get to really feel how much wisdom he's got. Um Coach Albert, <laughs> his abs are like you could cut butter with those abs. So, Sam? Sam who? Marami tayong Sam Sir John. Oh! A Johnny. It would be Mommy Shirley. Wow, that body is amazing. Okay, because I follow her on Instagram and I can see super ganda yung nung body niya. Tabs ba talaga yung nakita mo ka tabs? I think Hans doesn't give himself enough credit. He probably has the <laughs> best <laughs> But I gotta go with Ari. If the guy is 40 years old and looks as ripped as a 20 year old. Ari again. Yeah. <laughs> Can't lie. Ari, what are you eating, man? <laughs> or not eating. <laughs> yeah. I don't eat anything. <laughs> like Ayuda. Uh, Sogniamo un mondo senza più violenza. Un mondo di giustizia d'esperanza. Wow. 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 <laughs>
amazing. I'm not getting high. I'm sure you can take yes, I think the best quality of a superpower is having a good personality. To practice self-love and believe in themselves. You just get broken anywhere you want. That is a century too now. My name is Nicholas Chua. You can call me Nico for short. My name is Kayla Trahano. I am Chua. I am LGBTQI community that we can also be a fit inspiration. Fitness should be fit. Diet is really the key to a healthy lifestyle. A super bot should not just be physically fit or mentally fit. He should be what I want to call as holistically fit. This is the final callback for the hottest summer event this year. My goodness everyone looked absolutely amazing very fit and healthy and might I say gorgeous stunning they were all strong sexy and healthy this is for everybody oh my goodness I'm getting chills Kirikili ako your everybody super bot 2020 finalist there you have it do you have your favorites already well, comment down below, right there, where you've been commenting. We want to see more of your comments. And you might be one of the lucky viewers to receive a special gift from Century Tuna. If you're one of those who thought that summer was already canceled, or it felt like summer is canceled, well, there you have it. The Century Tuna Superbods, every bod super bod competition is just going to make you feel like it's still very much on. We are going to heat things up. Don't you worry. We are so lucky to witness the amazing and inspiring journey of our finalists. They are now geared towards a new chapter in this competition. So watch out for their upcoming activities leading up to the finals night. This is going to be exciting. Guaranteed. Now, if there's something I know for sure, seeing the finalists is not the only thing that's getting everyone excited. Hmm. Speaking of which, we now reach the part where we will talk to the ultimate super bods. I know you've been waiting for this all throughout the show. I will not keep you waiting any longer. Here it is. Are you all ready? Sabi nila, fish lang every day at walang imposible if you want to achieve a super bod. Kaya we want to know how these two keep themselves in shape and strong no matter what the situation is. Are you ready for our special guests? You know what? Even though I'm here, I can hear everyone screaming, Yes! We are excited! Bring them out! Okay, I will not keep you waiting. Hang in there. Let's welcome Nadine Lustre and Alvin Richards. 
Hello, Nadine. Hi, Alan. Hi. Hi. Kamusta? Hi, Miss Shelly. Hey, Alden. Hi, Nads. Miss Shelly. All right. First of all, let's uh, have Nadine say hello to all the viewers. Hi, everyone. Thank you all for being here. Oh my God, it's been so long. Um, it, it, this is so hard to do. I mean, the, the Zoom interview, it's so hard to do. I'm not used to this, but I guess we all have to adjust to the new normal now. So I'm just really excited. You know what? And everyone's excited. They've been waiting for you. They've been wanting to see you. Hi, Alden. Hi, hey, Michelle. And uh, hello to all the viewers who's watching us. And thank you for joining us for this lunch. You know, can I just say, and I know I am saying this for everyone else, we are so thankful to have both of you here. We want to know how has life been so far? Let's start with you, Nads. Oh my God, it's been really crazy. Um, so um, we all know that it's been a hard couple of months, but to be honest, I really enjoyed it because I learned new things, uh, picked up new hobbies. I got to do things that I haven't done in a while that I've always wanted to do. Um, discovered that I can actually write. So right now I'm working on my music. Ooh. Oh my goodness, did she just hint on an upcoming album? Yeah. yeah. You heard it here first. All right. That is something for everyone to look forward to. I'm pretty sure yeah. na excite silang lahat dyan. What about you, Alden? How is life so far? Uh, Siyempre coming from a laid-back uh, community quarantine back in uh, sa province namin sa Laguna. Medyo back to work na ako this mm -hmm. past couple of weeks. Uh, I've been doing it pulaga already for the past uh, three or four weeks now. Kaya lang medyo... You know, everyone is adjusting to the new normal. Parang coming from a jam-packed studio with a lot of audience. Ngayon, parang we're just a group of 30 to 40 people inside the studio. And uh, medyo, hindi kami senay because as hosts, we get our energy from the audience. Pero ngayon nga, parang we just get energies, energy from ourselves na lang. So, like, uh, bawas din yung host. Uh, we're just a group of five uh, hosts na main host ng Eat Bulaga and aside from that, uh, medyo may mga shoots na rin on the side. I've been uh, doing a lot of campaigns and uh, parang shoots for uh, endorsements as well and also checking up on the businesses, uh, restaurants natin. Uh, thankfully, uh, no uh, restaurant branch will shut down. Thank you to our, to our partners. Yeah, and uh, aside from that, uh, online gaming, uh, game streaming, I've uh, entered that world already because it has been a dream. <laughs> Parang uh, since I was young, I was uh, already a gamer. I was seven years old uh, with my brother. So now that's uh, it's a really a great privilege to showcase my gaming skills uh, through uh, streaming on uh, streaming platforms for for the games that I play. Wow, mukhang may mga natupad palang ano pangarap at panaginip during the quarantine. Yeah. <laughs> meron po, meron, meron. Yeah. So. So gamer, tapos yung isa working on her album. Good to know. But what everyone is curious about right now is how were both of you able to stay fit during the quarantine, stay fit and healthy. Why don't we start with you, Alden? Yeah. <laughs> Ngayon, uh, syempre kahit uh, nagsara yung mga gym and then yung uh, parang physical contact, physical uh, appearance nung uh, I mean physical. Yung, yung train, your trainer being physically present in your uh, place is prohibited. I, well, syempre, everyone is going online now. Yeah. So, i, uh, parang we've uh, come up with a certain arrangement na we just go online and then my trainer will just guide me on how to work out with the things that I have at home. So, parang yung mga improvise, and dami ngayon naglalabas ng online na improvise equipments. Mm -hmm. Like, yeah. uh, you use uh, different, uh, in common things at home to be your equipment for working out. So, andyan yung mga bottles, andyan yung mga parang mga century 2 na cans na nilalagyan ng laman and then you stack them together to create dumbbells, etc. So, uh, yeah, and then you, you really have to find a way to make the most of your time despite of this pandemic that we're in. It's all about being creative talaga. Creative with your exercises still. What about you, Nads? How did you stay fit and healthy? Oh my god, to be honest, I'm not gonna lie, it was really hard. Um, it, it's so hard to diet because you can have whatever you want. And, you know, um, how many months of ECQ? Three months. So you have like all these things that you can order and everyone's learning how to cook new things. Like there are new like cakes, 
Merong mga basta like a lot cupcakes, like all that, and all your friends are selling. So they're all trying to, you know, like come up with new businesses and puro food. So they would always ask me if they can send me stuff. So ako naman siempre yes, because this is the time for me to like enjoy whatever I want, because I'm a foodie. But then eventually I realized that I have to get back into it. So um, I rented a I rented a bike at one point, and I was taking classes for like a month. Well, actually not a month. I rented the bike for a month. I think I used the bike like three or four times long. But yeah, <laughs> and then. Um, my friend sold me a, a, a megaformer, so now um, I'm doing Pilates. I'm using it now almost every day. So trying to get back into it, trying to get fit again. Yes, absolutely. That's something that we have to do for ourselves, right? Good to know that Gaya na sinabi nyo, you have to get back into shape, get back into fitness and staying healthy. You know, this time around, the Superbots competition aims to provide the stay strong mindset despite the challenges. We want to know how both of you stayed strong given the current situation. I think I will have uh, Nadine take this one first. It was really tough, um, to be honest, because there's so many things happening, um, you know, not only here in the Philippines, but like everywhere in the world as well. There's so many bad news like every day. Um, so there's so much going on. It's hard because I live with my brother lang and my assistant and my dog. So. Um, I don't have a lot of friends near like this area around the area so I would always just talk to them message them they would always check up on me um, I'm really lucky because they're always there to support me and they didn't really stop you know like kind of um, nagging, but they would always message me like every day how is it how are you so yeah, I'm really lucky I have, you know, um, friends who really care about me, of course, family as well. Mm. Just finding, again, creative ways of uh, connecting with the people that you don't see physically. Yeah. Well, good to know that they were there for you. I'm pretty sure they wouldn't want it any other way. What about you, Alden? How did you stay strong? Um, actually, at first, it's hard because we're not really used to this kind of setup. Yeah. Especially uh, ECQ and daming uh, protocols that you have to comply with, and uh, but I really used uh, most of my quarantine time spending with uh, spending time with family friends. Na hindi ko hindi ko siguro na I'd like to say nagampanan in the past uh -oh. five years that I've been working 24 seven. Uh, mm -hmm. I only get to message them, you know, just say a simple hi or hello sa text. But uh, I really use this time para to mend, to mend the holes na hindi ko na parang to be with family. So I uh, get more time to talk to them na kaharap sila, not just online or through any forms of media. But uh, I really took, took that time to stitch up yung mga nawalang moments. So, uh, kasi for me, uh, parang ayoko kasi na the, I would not let this situation get the best of me. I will not let this dictate uh, my living. I would not let this dictate my life in the yeah. days to come. So it's really up to uh, that person. Eh. Parang, yes, we're, we're facing a really difficult time right now. Yeah. And uh, we're all, you know, mahirap sa atin lahat to. Parang, it's never an easy road to take. But yeah. really, it's up to that person. It's really up to you on how you will take this. If you wanna just go with it and you know beat the pandemic that we're in right now to live a better life, then that's a, the way to live. Because you know everyone is you know and daming like what Natin said and daming nangyari all over the world hindi lang yeah. pandemic. I love how you said na nangyayari naman to sa lahat. It really depends on you how you are going to handle it and how you are going to make something positive out of it. But for now, let's forget about the quarantine. Pinagdaanan na natin yun. <laughs> let's make it. Let's have something a little bit lighter. So we're done with that. We've realized ways in which we can cope and we can still become productive and creative. Let's uh, do something that's a little bit more fun right now. Earlier, you have seen the quirky side of our finalists and our fun games. It is now your turn, both of you, Alden and Nadine, to be faced with these challenges. Itong gusto kong malaman, ready na ba kayo? Oh my God! Kaya naman! Tignan natin, tignan natin. 
<laughs> okay, so let's do this. For our first round, you just have to choose from the choices that I'd be giving you. Okay, let's start with round one. This or that? This or that. Oh. This right. or that. To both of you, burpees or push-ups? Oh my god, burpees. burpees. Wow! Impressive! Ang hirap ng burpees ha. Karamihan ang tao parang, no to burpees. Okay, just for Alvin, boxers or briefs? Boxers. Okay. To both, again, going to the mall or go to the beach? Go, go to, to the, the beach. beach. <laughs> Pareho talaga. Na tayo beach. Okay, for Nadine, would you rather wear a one-piece swimsuit or a two-piece bikini? Two-piece bikini. Oh, yeah. yes! Yeah. <laughs> now, for both of you, Nadine and Alvin, a century tuna flakes in vegetable oil or hot and spicy? Hot and spicy. Vegetable oil. Sayo, Alvin, hot and spicy. Yes, hot and spicy. Okay, dun lang kayo nagkaiba. Yeah. Interesting. <laughs> Very interesting to know your choices. And now for the second round, we call this Who's Who? I am going to ask a question and your answer must be a person that you identify with. Are you ready? Okay. 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 <laughs> <laughs> Napapaisip sila. Oh no, we're going yeah. to name a person. Here we go. If you were to prepare a fancy dinner for a loved one, who is that person? Okay, we want a name. Who is that person? And what century tuna dish would you serve? Let's start with you, Nadine. Be okay. Um, my friends, Debbie and Lauren, and then I would make them a tuna pasta. Oh, nice. Because, um, can I say the backstory though, why I chose them? <laughs> No, because me and uh, my girls, we have pasta nights, so we make our own pasta. So, yeah, I would serve them tuna pasta. We'll make the pasta and then um, I'll, I'll put the century tuna and all the other ingredients in it. Yeah. Nice. All right. For the friends, a tuna pasta dish. What about you, Alden? Who will you prepare it for and what century tuna dish? Are you going to serve that person? Oh yeah, so go to my, my sister, Raisa. Okay. So I'll serve her the, of course, my favorite also in Hunt and Spicy. Because we, both of us, may lik talaga kami sa manghang na pagkain. So, and that's parang satisfying your craving at the same time being healthy. You know what, I have a feeling when our viewers have hot and spicy now, they'll be thinking of you. You know, it's Alden serving me this dish. And if it's tuna pasta, Nadine made this tuna pasta for me. Thank you for your answers. Pardon, say that again? That's actually one of my favorite dishes, tuna pasta. Marami nang gagawa niyan ngayon. And I'm pretty sure Century Tuna will come up with plenty of tuna pasta dishes. Thank you for your answers, Alden and Nadine. We're not done yet because for our last round, hindi pa, hindi pa tapos. This is called Show It Off. Hmm, what is that about? It is just a simple challenge for both of you. If you are ready, let's begin with round three. Show it off. Can you show to us the sexiest part of your body? Let's start with Nadine. This part. I think a lot of people agree. <laughs> My collarbones. <laughs> yes. <laughs> yeah. You know, the minute I saw you, Nadine, that was the first thing I saw, and that was the first thing I appreciated. Talaga, wow, nice collarbones. Tata oh, all. Thank you. <laughs> yes. If people <laughs> told you that. Hindi na kami milky every day. Hindi kasi bumalik na sa ano? Pagiging fit eh. Kaya okay na ulit. Ah ah. Thanks to the ano yan, thanks to the spinning bike and the reformer. What? Yeah. Ayan. Oh, Alden, it's your turn. What are you going to show off? The sexiest part of your body. Siguro ito na lang. My, my arm siguro. <laughs> yan kasi yung talagang uh, very dominant when I, when I work out. So, yeah, it's the arms. Oh, oh. okay. Really good. Thank you so much. Kinili kami don, and we will agree with you. 
sexiest part and dominant nga talaga. Thank you so much. That was fun. Thank you, Nadine and Alden, for your time. But don't leave yet. No more games for you. Don't worry. Don't okay. leave yet because I'll be calling back our finalists to join us in this closing or in closing the show. Super Boss, show yourselves once again and say hi to Nadine and to Alvin. Hi, hi Alvin. Hey, They will engage in a series of activities leading up to the finals on September 19. Mark your calendars. You don't want to miss that date. Again, September 19. Just follow Century Tuna Superbots on Facebook to get updates about our finalists. Now, since we are all here, everybody is here, the gang's all here, this is a perfect opportunity to spread the word about the Stay Strong Mindset. Let us strive to be a better version of ourselves through exercise, positive thinking, and a proper diet with Century Tuna. Together with the Superbots finalists, Alden Richards and Nadine Luzve, let's always remember... Stay strong! Stay strong! Stay strong. Stay strong. Stay strong.